Hello everyone, welcome back to Rome and it is of course the Alternative History Campaign with myself and Malekith. Hello Malekith. Hello. And at this current moment, um, Malekith is suffering from a bit of a brain fart um, as you're obviously trying to keep a lot of campaigns inside your brain and they're starting to leak out somewhat and you're having a little bit of uh, issues relating to that, is that not correct? Yeah, uh, Egypt's definitely merged into Rome because they're in the same area of the map. This one's a slightly more fresh, I just don't quite remember what... I know my armies were failing horribly, I just don't remember why or how bad. <laughs> fantastic, fantastic. And it's actually, um, I do believe uh, it's your go. Uh, we've got to obviously check out ARS because that's always got to be done. Um, so, yeah, it's remembering where we are, really. Now, you were, you were starting to make progress up um, Spain sort of areas. You'd start to make an inroad into Spain, and I was trying to deal with um, the Cisapenia or whatever the hell it's called around that area to sort of buffer myself from, um, you know, the other areas up above. I started making inroads, and then I got attacked from every which direction because my stupid client states decided they were going to declare war on everyone under oh, the sun. Oh, that was it. Yeah, your your atropies were a pain in the backside, to say the least. Let's see if I can piece out the Keltiki. Yeah, that's got to be done. Hang on. He just said, "Gods of the afterlife, spare my ass." I'm sure. Really? Yeah. Okay. I wish I hadn't clicked the button and I could actually read what he was saying, but okay. no, never mind. I'm you, sure the you, chat will enlighten us. Yeah, yeah, probably will, actually. Um, Apparently, yeah, uh, all this talk of cheese is making Luna Dusk hungry, so it's very important, Luna Dusk, at this time of stress, that you don't think about cheese sandwiches or ham sandwiches or cheese toasties or, you know, bread and butter and things like that. I'm sure Luna's always eating when it comes to the live stream. He's forever disappearing to go make his food or something along those lines. Yeah, he's like the United Kingdom version of Dodger. Always yeah. eating. Just slightly lower pitch voice, hopefully. Yes, and smaller breast, hopefully. Okay, moving swiftly on. We need to recap. Um, where the hell... Oh, but if I do that, they're going to come out and ambush. Arr. No, screw it. That's going to be the end of the turn, and I'm likely to get attacked. Here we go. Eh? Maybe I won't go to war with Syracuse, they've just come to kill my rebels that I was sure I had somewhere but couldn't quite remember where they were. Indeed. Indeed. Yeah, I'm just going to auto-resolve that. I'm not chasing them around the map for however... We'll let Syracuse take all the damage. Mm-hmm. They come to deal with your rebellious hordes. That's very nice of them. Yeah, it is polite, isn't it? You know? I'm going to take what them back as slaves again and then uh, make some money off them. Mm-hmm. That's fair. Yes, this... Uh... Ooh, the Edetani want a peace treaty. Ooh. Now, it's tempting, but I have all of my armies camped outside of their town. And it's their only town, isn't it? Yeah. It is. It's also in the province that I'm kind of warm. Yeah. Yeah, it's us. He wants us. If I need to stop these jokes, <laughs> I, yes, we 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 will decline the peace treaty. <laughs> uh, they what now? They they they've brought their army out for a naval fight. Oh, those oh, stupid asses. Uh, which it thinks I can win quite comfortably. <laughs> I'd, I'm i actually tempted to auto-resolve this rather than fight it because we know how much I hate naval battles. And you're missing out on all the arse jokes in chat as well. 
No, I, I can unfortunately see those out in the corner of my <laughs> eye. <so laughs> it's most distracting. Excellent. Although this guy can't spell, apparently I need my Aries. <laughs> no. I'm not feeling up to naval battles. Screw that plan. Screw that ass. Yep, yeah, never mind. Okay. They they nearly sunk my heffalumps, but not quite. Oh, wow, that could have been bad. I'm not sure how four heffalumps survive, but, you know. Well, they float quite well, apparently. Oh, that would be a great strategy. Just have the elephants sort of cannonball off the side of the ship and no. cause a massive wave. No, even better. Explosive heffalumps, like the uh, medieval, no, sorry, not the medieval, the Roman equivalent of a sea mine. These floating heffalumps. <laughs> <laughs> but they, but they're like limpet mines. They can, they can attach themselves to the hull of a ship with their trunk. Yeah. Dude, yeah. Now I've just got mental images of them having their trunk above the water, and it's some sort of like submarine snorkel, <laughs> salt squad. And then they all group together and uh, pull the ship down like a big kraken with their trunks. A heffalump pack. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh dear. That's got to be yeah. done. Precursor of the wolf pack, the heffalump pack. Absolutely. Oh dear. Anyway. They went out with Greek fire. Yes. Elephant submarine assault squad. Oh dear, oh dear. Okay, an agent has recovered from, vic uh, from injury is now ready to serve me. Well, that's lovely. Unfortunately, you've come back to life in the village I've already taken, so you're a little bit late now, I'm afraid. Never mind. Posthumia scapula. You with Liguria yet, were you? Uh, not yet, anyway. You're um, still so recovering your Hastati armies. I am, so I need to... They're still recovering, so I'm going to... Let's see. Yeah, send the spy up here, I think. To mm. sniff out Medlan. Ooh. Mm. Um, so they look like they've got a 13-stack army and an eight-stack army, called the Warmongers, ironically enough, and the Heralds of Death, which they don't realise it'll be their own death, but, you know, details. Oh, you little bastard. What? Uh, I'm just looking at the unhappiness of Commander. provinces. Okay. Although Nova Cathago are bringing friends. Oh, no, that's always a bad sign. Well, they're by uh, client state, so it should be good. All oh, right, okay. Right, so let's see what units... No, I can't recruit Diddly Squat there because we're still building stuff, aren't we? Right, okay. Don't have a lot of money, so... Let's see. What's the happiness like? So it's a zero. My, negative 31. So... What's negative 31? Um, pa Patavium. Oh. So... I'm going to build a consecrated ground and then hopefully build up the size of that build, um, that area. So it means you then... You can recruit whatever the female agent calls it, Dignitary. She can convert their uh, religion. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll do that. But I don't have the money at the moment, unfortunately. Um, oh, Noria's got a big army over there. But we're not worried about them for the time being. Um... Let's see. Hmm. Um, we don't have an army in Velasari, which worries me. You're making me want to make a t-shirt with underwater elephants now. Excellent. Excellent. It's just a silhouette of an elephant with its trunk up above and then the water line. Yeah, yeah. And a boat on the, on the other side. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You need the Jaws music in the background. Yeah, yeah, you're not you're not really going to get that on the t-shirt, or, yeah, um, I don't know. Yeah, How... we're building a little thing where you push a button and it starts playing out of a mini speaker in oh, the shirt somewhere. Oh, God, yeah. That has potential. Uh, yeah, I don't have the money to convert it, so they'll change anyway. But in the meantime, I'm just allowing these armies to recover their numbers. It's taking time. Um, if you put the one outside in the sort of defensive fort stance, I think he replenishes quicker. Okay. I might be wrong. 
It will tell you when you hover over the stance, I think. Right. Defences, melee defence, defences, reinforcement, 50% reinforcement range. Okay, That's we'll do range. that. Yeah. So he's got spikes now coming out of the ground, which is fine. That's your command. And this guy here is just reinforcing normally. So that's fine. We need to do some new research, however. Hmm. Let's see. Siege tour. Now, hmm. No training reform? Hmm. Let's have a look. Clippity clops. Weapon proficiency. Okay. Alright, let's do some manipula organization. Let's start improving the troops somewhat. Hang on a minute. I was intentionally letting the rebels take Lily Bayum so Syracuse would capture it afterwards and then you could come take it. Yes. God damn it, Syracuse, why did you help? You could have had a town. I know, I know. Isn't that always the way, though? Okay, let's see. I've still got one fleet available. I have no diggies, so I need to get a dig in. Um, so I shall do that at some point after... I've converted Hatvium to a Roman enclosure. So there's not much I can do at the moment until I do that. I don't have the money for that. Um, let's just quickly check everything on the armies. Jemina over at... Yeah, Cassentia, they're doing okay. Full stack army. Almost. We've got these guys here, Herculea, looking a little bit, hmm. Okay. I'm sure it is. That's Carthage. That's Carthage. Okay. I'm gonna stick... What's your navy up to at the moment? Nothing. I'm just gonna stick it near Corralis just to give you a bit of protection if you needed it. Uh, yeah. It's either that or you bring it across, but I don't think I'm going to go up against Taraco for a while. I'm going more central Spain, so it probably won't be much help. Okay, I just put them in raiding mode, so hopefully that should enable them to intercept anybody who comes over for a punch-up. Oh, nope, they're back to the arse jokes again. Excellent, glad to hear it. Okay, so I think I've done everything I can there. Oops. Let's see if I've got any options for trade. Nova Carthago might be able to trade. The pleasures of my household are yours. They're my um, client states, they should be happy to. Yeah, good. We have heard of your great wisdom. Yes, indeed, you should have done the Nori. Let's try here. We glad to listen to your offers, but do not trap them in No, they've declined. I... Even though they liked me, those gits. Um, let's see. Might just mean they don't have anything actually to trade. Yeah, that's a possibility. No, I don't want to trade with the Sistani, because... I don't uh, Sestani. You can trade with Sestani if you want. I'm not going to be going against them for a while. Okay. Good. More trade. We have good reason to. Um. Let's see. Greetings, friend. We will speak together of whatever you wish. Okay. Nori, you've said no. I do wish it would st stop resetting these. Um, filter that I put on um, every time I do a flipping. Oh, well, it, yeah, where it reorganizes yeah. the list. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now speak as you will and try to. Okay. Uh, 
I try Libya, what the hell. Come, my friend. Trade agreement. We are men of war. Good, another one. On behalf of my people. So on behalf of your people, shut up, I'm done with you. Epirus. Greetings. Greetings. Civilized folk, so you may speak as are you talking to Epirus? Yeah. Trying to make friends with the Greeks. Yeah, well, you know, I might as well, you know, get money off them until I have to kill them. Greetings, my friend. Yeah, sure up the you eastern side with friends and we can march around Central Europe first. Exactly, yeah. They didn't accept it, but, you know, it's always worth a go. It's worth a punt. Okay. I don't think I've done those guys. Let's try a them. tongue that speaks without wisdom is not welcome. Be like a spear. Nope. Uh, okay. So, I'm done there on my diplomacy. Uh, done all the diplo I can handle. Um, okay. Hmm. Move up there, young lady, and stay, stay safe. Now, let's have a look. So, we're okay there. Halifai. Yeah, pos posthumia scapula. That just sounds like a disease of the backside, the posterior. <laughs> Okay. Or right. some sort of nasty sounding sort of beheading of your rear. Yes, yes, definitely. Okay. So they've still got their general, Sextus Viteris. Um, now, if I remember rightly, didn't I have a hero somewhere? You might want to send your spies slightly further west of Medland, just so you can see both of their towns. Gives you an idea of how many armies they've got. Yeah, that's a fair argument. Let's send her over there. There we go. At least we can keep an eye on anything that's going in between. Okay. Right, I don't have a hero, so I need to recruit one at some point. I need to recruit a... Um, Dignitary and get them into Patavium and also let's see what have we got in a Um okay. Right, I don't have the scholarship ability. Ah, that's why. And I don't have manipular organization yet, so I'm doing that now. Manipulative organization is being done. And then scholarship. I haven't recruited any, or sorry, investigated anything there. Let's have a look. Where is scholarship? I presume it's in one of those ones. So, we'd, yeah, it'll be in civil. So, I think after I've done manipulative organization, which should be done in two mm -hmm. turns, I shall recruit civil. I'll do civil and go from there. My moderator just nukes the chat for some reason. I'm guessing by the oops, it was High Lord. Yeah. Yeah, no, he cleared cleared all the chat. Someone's getting demoted to cadet. Yeah. Misclicked on the gear. It's always good when, you know, one of your guys has an aim that bad. <laughs> oh, dear. Never mind. Okay, right, so I'm done there as far as I'm concerned. Oh. Um, in Italia, Rome, they're unhappy, but it is going up by 10. Um, in Suspenia, oh, that's where Patavium is, so, yeah, that's going to go up by zero, so hopefully that will get fixed by the public consecrated ground, and then I'll fix the other problem, so, yeah, I've done all I can. I am ending turn. No promotion, success! Rebellion in Lilibeum, and oh, that's the one that got crushed before it even really happened. Really? Okay. Those rebellious dogs. Rebellion imminent in Cartagenesis. Alright, we'll go have a look at that in a second then. That just sounds like a uh, something you do, uh, do to someone to find out if they've got a disease. 
We're setting a definite tone here with the th helps of the chat. Where's Carter to Genesis? I would have thought. Um... Oh. Ah, rebellion imminent in the area that I'm fighting in. Screw you, game. <laughs> Right. Step one. Beach town. Mm. Are you? Yeah, it's us again. And troops to support. Bring up more troops to support. Bring up more troops to support. That's a lot of arse activity. Prepare to be sat on by multiple elephants. Go. Prepare for heifer lumpage. Oh, they're all on the boat as well, so we can just queue them up if need be. Now, there's quite a few units here that are actually heavily wounded, which I'll be sitting out of the fight, but... Understandable. As with most of early game Carthage, the elephant should win it easily for you. Of course, of course. Elephant versus boat. Interesting. See, this is now time for the elephant mines. Yeah. Because, I mean, that we they used to have those pigs that you could set on fire and send after elephants. So why shouldn't we have elephant mines? That's what I should say. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm to speak to CA when I see them at, uh, at the event. And just say elephant, elephant mines, and elephant submarines are a thing. It has to happen. I, I like the way you you worded that. Like flaming pigs is just like a native thing you find laying around in the wild somewhere. Yeah, of course. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That's yeah, how the barbecue was in. Flaming pigs. You know, they were just they're running wild in the trees. You could find them everywhere. Yeah, but the thing is, yeah. To be honest, <laughs> if they're running wild in the trees, you could find them just by following the fire. You follow the forest fire. That's how yeah. ancient forest fires happen. That's pretty Boys much girls, it. You heard it here first. That's why, that's why England was covered, like two thirds of it was covered by forest. And then came along the flying, the flying pigs? No, the flaming pigs. And it all went to pot. So, yeah. Flaming. People have asked, how do you get elephants as Carthage? What do you build? The answer is generals. Elephants. They just happen. <laughs> all generals go on elephant equals win. Yes. Right. The two ships are beaching as quickly as possible before they get jumped by all the other ships. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. One of them's not very healthy and the other one will get rammed to death almost immediately. Good to hear. Right, I'm watching missile raiders. Raiders of the Lost Arse. Um. Oh, dear. <laughs> Sorry. Yep, yep. They're now they literally just changed course, and I'll put uh, going for you directly. Okay, I'll give you those three. Oh God! Responsibility. This is scary. All right. All right. All of them can come. Oh, they're landing on the beach. What are they? It's all raiders. Yay. I'm bring the uh, slingers over to get them. Yeah, already on the way, mate. Bro, faster. No, they've just changed course to aim for your ships for ramming directly. Yep, that's why I'm trying to ram the beach first. <laughs> Actually, screw it. Let's throw some javelins back at them. I'll give you these javelins in a minute once I've uh, no, sorry, mate. their ship a little bit. I'm going to throw, try and throw some flaming javelins at this bunch of missile raiders, see if we can set their boat on fire. 
You might just be better off trying to kill them, to be honest, by the look of it. Mm. Who's coming out of the town? Right, slingers are engaging. Yeah, they're down to 20 men. And they're away. See ya, fellas. Thanks for coming to the party. Right, let's give you these. Uh, there you go. Thank you. One. Right. We're going to wait for them on the beach. We shall uh, fight them on the beaches. Coming. Let's have a look. Cavalry on foot. Cavalry on foot. Swordsmen and skirmishers. What I will do is I'll send you the swordsman. Okay. I'm basically going to have them lining up on the beach when they beach. Basically, it's just going to engage them with mass javelins, mass flaming javelins, in fact, and uh, lots of rocks. Oh, they've left their skirmishes on the edge of town exposed. Go on, cavalry, get them. You never want to expose your skirmishes, especially in battle. Obviously been trained by Gamer, he likes exposing himself. Yeah, I've heard that. And the cavalry are in there. Oh, lovely. Oh, and the boats are now moving to the left. It's alright, we shall... Yeah, the boats have stopped moving towards the beach now. No, 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 they're back to the beach again. Oh. It's all a big tactical ploy. They're trying to lure us into a feeling of false security. Or true security, I suppose, in this case. Right, so, let's see. Let's get these guys there. And then these guys. There. Here they come. Hello, fellas. Oh. Welcome to the yeah, fiery javelin. Yeah, them off before they get away. Yeah, I don't think fire is really necessary. Just go for the kills. Okay. Loyal sons of Carthage, you won't burn the boat down in time. Oi! Warriors, eager for blood. Right, I'm going to get the uh, slingers. Do you want to focus the other one? It's got a lot more men on it. Yeah, okay. These ones will be uh, broken in the first charge of my infantry hit. It certainly hasn't got a lot of men left now. Down to 68 and counting. One of our units has used all its ammunition. No, don't run into battle, you bloody fools. Ugh. Idiots. Got a unit coming across. Yep. Rain's go. Yep. Down on the beach. Right, so we'll get these guys over here. Oh no. Their enemy general has died. Oh, we need to get these guys out. I was going to lose them. Yeah, they're running. So, sorry about that. That's fine. I'm gonna focus these swordsmen coming in. Yep, yep. Whereabouts? Oh, right. Oh, these, uh. Yep, mercenary swordsmen, I see him. The welcoming party is rating. 
Yeah, they're yeah, they're pretty screwed. They're charging you guys, so I'll just hit them in the side then. Excellent. Oh yeah. Look, even better, you can attack them in the rear. And the other raised units are hopping off their boat. They can have three units of swordsmen to the face. Yeah, get my javelin men on them. And get some slingerific fun going too. People in chat are asking how do you kill so many people with skirmishes? The key is attacking from the side or attacking light units. Mm -hmm. Oh dear, veteran shield warriors. Okay, we're back up now. Sorry about that. You're back. <coughs> Technical right, problems were experienced. They've got a fleet of one boat. I have four boats, I think. Oh no, it's a garrison army. Oh, no, we're not doing that. Run away! I'm tempted to time out Lordrian just for that joke. Just on principle alone. Right. Uh, I think I'm going to end turn there once I've picked my uh, research for the next turn. <laughs> Let's start doing some civil technologies. Apparently you committed arson. Uh, have you seen the next, the other one? Yeah. Oh dear. <sighs> you unlocked their booty with the key of brute force. <laughs> Oh dear, you guys. <laughs> well, the way I see it, if you're going to hell, you might as well earn it. Dad? Yes? Can you stop raiding my province? I'm getting minus 20 happiness. What? Oh, well, my, oh sorry. Really? I'm, I, Your navy. Oh, is it my navy that's causing a problem? I'm sorry. Yeah. I will... <laughs> why? Uh, why? <laughs> Yeah, you think, oh, allies, we're not going to raid each other's stuff, but no, apparently not. Welcome to Rome. Oh, God. Okay. I'll stop ra raging, raging around your area. I, I'll put them on the tickling with feathers option. Cool. Those husky marines just feather assaulting each other. Yes. I'm sure that's a mental image everyone wanted. Beating each other with scented boot laces. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that was not an image I needed. Oh, you're welcome, Internet. Uh, right. Ending turn. Let's see what the AI does this time. Is that the Swaby declaring war on you? No. No, no, not yet. As I say, you haven't met them yet. How are they managing that? Oh, they'll oh, manage. Oh, no, wait, 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 oh, wait. Oh, no. There's a rebel army with annoying amounts of units, but the, um, the Stani have come down to fight it. Oh, huzzah. And asked for my assistance. And you're not going to help them? Well, it's in my territory because it's a rebel force oh. in my. Hmm. So sure, I'll help them. What, what's with the AI being helpful all of a sudden? What is this? Hmm. Very disturbing. I think this oh is no, the prelude my to war with Garrison everyone. Garrison got slaughtered. Oh no. Oh no. All those plebs. Did you did you did you see? By the way, I don't know if you've seen. There's actually. A program on uh, on television now called Plebs. It's a comedy program <laughs> about about basically the lower levels of um, uh, Rome. And one guy, one, yeah, one guy basically, um, you know, uh, I think he he caught the clap off a cat or something. I don't know. It's kind of strange. Um, okay, Libya have offered me a non-aggression pact. Are you happy with that? Because they're right next to you. Then my client state, go for it. Okay. 
There we go. This one, there's a TV series called Cadets that I'm going to have to worry. Oh, yeah. Maybe, maybe it'll be a merge of the series. Oh. Oh, okay. Faction destroyed. The Canterbury have been scattered to the winds. Huh? Um, loaded dice. Plus two morale. Eh? The Celtiberian Confederation. I'm guessing, yes, the, the faction the to the west absorbed the, um, whatever, the guys we were fighting. Mm -hmm. Okay, Did well, more. Brotherly love, we're the same sort of race and come join the confederation thing. Fair dues, more people to kill. I'm good with that. Fortunately, okay. they haven't inherited the war, so that's good. Okay, so patrol. I've changed them to patrol and it should be minus 25 piracy in this region now. Cool. So hopefully that should... Yep, that's sort of the happiness out. It's oh, back up to positive. But I'm only at 354 on money, so... Let's see, I guess it's because, let's put up the, the tax just a little bit and hopefully we'll get more money next time around. Okay, let's see who's unhappy. Let me there. Okay. Hmm. Rather large army you've got sat in Consentia doing generally nothing, nothing. Yeah, they were basically just um keeping the the toe of uh, Italy safe, I guess. I, I, you could probably just march into Syracuse and kill them if you really wanted to. Mm, yeah, I probably could actually. But, you know, that's the point, I need to start getting rid of some of these mercenaries and start hiring proper units. Hmm. Yeah, to be honest, I'm... I don't know. What do you reckon? Because the thing is, if I take that, then there's a good chance you'll never get that back because of, obviously, you know, we're allied and all the rest of it. So I'm just ha having spoken to people in the know that I can't really mention. Apparently, yeah. you share because um, it's a co-op. If I own one part in the province and you own three, it counts as us owning it. Okay. Commander. Consider um, the massacre ready to start. I, I, I will direct you to the person to go and uh, complain to if it's all lies. Excellent, good to hear it. I shall be looking forward to slapping someone. Well, I want to speak to the person who does the AI in games anyway, because, um, you know, I mean, obviously with Medieval and then Napoleon and Shogun, everyone declares war against me. So I'm beginning to wonder if there's some kind of special Chadman code in there or something. Yeah, the function, if name equal Chadman, then yeah. W war equal one. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Right, so I'm going to go in after uh, Syracuse and uh, take that area. Okay. Um, the only thing to watch is they've got a navy up near Brundisium, so as long as you leave your army there. Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to move that army anywhere. So There's actually a fleet, so they can't get to Cosentia. Okay, that's fine. Well, let's go in and I will leave. Um, I've moved this army as far as it can. And then we'll go after Syracuse in the next turn. Um, technology is still one more there. And then I'll go for... Is it land? How many turns you guys in the north? Is it one or two more turns? Um, let's go and have a look, actually. Because I can't see the little pluses when I click them. Okay. Ready for orders. Yeah, three turns, two turns... Yeah, it's, uh, it's looking pretty close on that one. Ready for battle. Yeah, about another two or three turns until these guys are replenished. And then we can get them underway. Go and say hello to Medlan. Liguria. Definitely got to be done. Right, ending turn. 
and just not spending any money. I've just Rebellion. put the test. Yay! Oh, that was the one the guys came in and put down for me. That's all good. Mm hmm. Oh, they're still rebelling. Why are they still rebelling? Let's see. Because they're alive. Differences. Can't rebel if you're dead. Differences. Oh, I can't recruit dignitaries yet because I haven't done the research. Mm hmm. You for, I, that's what I forgot from my Rome campaign because I thought, oh, I'll recruit a dignitary. Oh, bugger. I walk them into there. That solves it a little bit. And I'm going to get a barracks over here because then I can actually recruit some of my own damn units rather than relying on these mercenaries all the time. And. I'm going to go head back to Kartuba and see if I can get that town back that I lost. You know what? I'm thinking I need to, once I can do it, make a dog army in. Uh, just have it roam mm -hmm. around. You know how well it works? Yep, absolutely. Oh, Nova Cathago have lost their uh, town, what would be. Um, oh, Gibraltar. Error. Hmm. It does mean the enemy's fairly weak, though, so I can probably sneak in and steal stuff. Yes, but then there's Always a good, good chance they're going to push in towards Tingis, which is its happiness is going down by minus 10 at the moment, mate. You probably want to get some troops in there. Where's Tingis? Oh, I'm sorry, that's Nova but... Carthago. Sorry, my apologies. Yeah, no, 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 do me. Yeah, not my problem. Uh, I should really be dealing with Africa as well, I think, but I'll worry about that when it becomes a problem. I think, for now, it can stay there. I need to get some money and this happiness under control. Right, any turn. Get more money, then you're happy. Oh, no. Uh, promotion. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Almost... Enables night battles. Oh, really? Yeah. I love the night battle option. It wins you uh, town assaults so easily. Really? Hmm. If they've got a town with, like, say, three armies outside protecting it, if you go in and attack the town directly and do a night battle, you only fight the garrison and whatever armies inside. All the ones outside can't come and help. Oh, see, that was... See, Nova Carthago and Carthage have declared war against the Helveti. I have? Yeah, well, it's going to be, I'm allied with Nova Carthago and Carthage. And the Nori, the, the Nori, the Nori, this faction's declared war on me, the Nori. So... Where the hell's the Helveti? Oh, um, they're... they're Allies of the they're Helveti. North, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They're up up north somewhere, but they're allied with the Nori, so the Nori have declared war against me. So ah, I see. Uh, yes, that's the guys to your northeast. Mm -hmm. And the Helveti are northwest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you've got that lovely issue where um, you need to run around in those mountains, like I was having problems with in the Suwabi campaign. Well, should I? Is it worth calling you guys to help, or should I just punch them in the face myself? Um, you're probably better off dealing with that one for yourself for the moment. Yeah, I'll do that then. Okay, that's fine. War has been declared. How lovely. I look forward to stoving your face in soon. Okay, manipular organisation has been successful. You want to run towards the Marian Marius reforms? You know the ones I mean. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Because um, that lets you upgrade all of your um, Hastati to much better units. Mm-hmm. Right, well, I've actually got to um, research land management so it unlocks the other stuff as well. So I'm going to do that. What's this? 
Damn it, he ran a huge army back to the town I was sneaking up on. Requires attention. A legendary character has been killed during a race. The people are heartbroken and this great man needs to be honoured. Oh dear. During a race? Mm-hmm. What was he racing? Bulls? I don't know, but he's going to have a statue. So hopefully the next race doesn't crash into that statue. Um, that will be a tad unfortunate. Right. So, research is now underway. And... I love how people have never actually played a co-op campaign think you can uh, declare war on each other. Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's have a look over here. Because these two armies now should be looking a lot healthier. Yeah, they're looking really good, so I'm going to leave them in place for a few more rounds. Ooh. you got your Syracuse thing, haven't you? Yep. Yep. Nice. You might just want to march south a little bit and check there's no more hiding in the fog. but Yeah, that's always a good bet. Off to Syracuse. Um, so, let's see. Let's march that way. Good, nobody there. Hello. Declare war. Uh, I won't bring you guys in to help. There's no point. They're not going to live that long. Where are you... What? what? I don't um, know. I don't know. It literally... I clicked on the town. And then it basically decided to go round the side. And then get into a boat. Oh. Thank you, AI. You back off the boat, or...? Thank you, yes, I'm getting them back off the boat, but I've now run out of movement, so I can't actually attack this turn. Now. <sighs> Thank you, General. Thank you, General. He's obviously got sea legs, so he must be a sea guy. And it's Gnea Scipio as well, so you would have think he would know better than to attack in water, especially with his ancestors. Anyway, so, yeah, we're going to go into there and then attack that way, and, uh, yeah, whatever. Okay. So now, ah, oh, that's better. We've got much better money now. So hopefully, over at Patvium, there we go, we can build a proper, yep, and it's increasing from minus 38 by 1, which is good nose, good nose indeed. Um, good nose? Yes, very good nose. Um, okay, so what I also need to do then, do I have enough? I may have enough. To recruit a champion. Oh, yes. Oh, wow. I can start taxing them again. Way. Cheerio. Gabrio. There we go. Right. There we go. Let us recruit this fine gentleman. And he... We'll go into Patvium and help train the troops. So, and then we'll create a dignitary in the next turn. Let me just quickly check to make sure. Oh no, yeah, I've got to do the scholarship, which is where on the tree. I guess it's under civil, yeah. So, I've got a few turns for that, so that's fine. Um, I can't really build anything on this army. I've got no options for recruiting units. Yeah, no recruiting options, that's fine. So, let's see. Minion. Oh, by the way, you're going to have to keep an eye on the time because I've no idea when we started this. Okay, yeah, I am keeping an eye on the time anyway, so. We started at 21.27. Cool. Was that when you restarted? That was when I... Yeah, oh, yeah, fair point. <laughs> oh god damn you sir we started at 2052 so yeah okay about 10 minutes left okay um done all i can there not going to do any more for the time being um these bloody idiots who are, think they're flipping 
floating around. Oh, all the guys that went for a, yeah. a, a boating outing. Yeah, three idiots, 20 idiots in the boat. Well, 16 idiots in the boat, but yeah, pretty much. Um, so yeah, they're still patrolling, so that's fine. Um, yeah, is, that, let's... is that the Bollywood edition of three idiots in a boat? Or yes, it, it is. Called? It is. Got to have more backing dancers. <laughs> Uh, and it was recruitment at dignitaries. Sold! Yay! Alright, yep, let's get in happiness and money now. Let's do both worlds. <laughs> Hang on, there's two worlds declared there. Nori on Rome. Rome on Syracuse, okay. Hmm. Hmm. That doesn't sound good. Well, they've put a huge army in Kartuba, so I can't take that off of them. So I'm going to move my better army back just so it's in range to reach other places. And Mao's armies reach places that other armies are unable to reach. Get rid of some of these mercenaries. I need to get rid of these ones, they're expensive. Alright, that's got me back a lot of money. Somebody, um, somebody's saying in chat, Carthage and Roma allies, it just doesn't make sense. Hence the reason why it's an alternative history campaign. Shh. Stop being sensible. Oh, I'm sorry, we're on the internet, aren't we? It might rub off. Oh, God. No, there's no, 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 no. Now we're going to get rub off jokes. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Damn you, sir. Damn you to hell. <sighs> hmm. That's 12% wealth from maritime commerce, where three of the four things in the province have ports. That sounds like a good plan. Fair dues. That is pretty much all of my money, however. Um, hmm. Not a lot going back on back in Carthage. Ah, we can issue an edict, however. Oh, it's currently bred in games, which is probably what's keeping the happiness up, so I probably better not reduce that. Fair dues. Yeah, that's what's keeping the happiness up. Um, well, there's not a lot I can do in my turn. Is there not? We go around once more and see what the AI gets up to. Yeah, what the hell? Should be a giggle. I really need them to move out of Kartuba so I can run over there and steal it. Half inch it. Uh oh. Hmm, hello Syracuse. Oh, they want us they want a peace treaty. Uh no. Yeah, they're gonna give me two thousand two thousand two hundred and eighty. Screw you. I have rejected your offer. When you do that attack, make sure you land your troops back on the ground first. I've already clicked that. I have already clicked that, believe me. Oh, here comes the Nori. What are they up to? Oh, they. Tell us that we offer oh, the Nori want a peace treaty. Treat. They just uh, declare war on me, and they're now offering me two thousand two hundred along with a peace treaty. You know what? I'm having that. Free money. Cha ching. Oh, remember, they got they got two twenty stacks up there. Yeah, well, just as well then. Death of a legend in Velathari. Local legend snuffed it. Well, you know, I did, you know, put up a. A, a statue for him. Oh, the Ray oh, the outcome of that? Were they happy with your statue or not so much? I don't know. I don't know. Just just click, in, click the button in the bottom middle and check there's not another event you need to deal with. Right. Oh, that's this general. 
He's a stranger to fear, likes Carthaginians. Oh, we can't have that. Um, Prudentia, tempers, okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about that. Oh no, he's just showing on my general, so there's no, there's nothing else to worry about at this current moment. However, there is the idiots down in Corsica who don't know how to flip in land on dry land. Oh, what the hell? Why? No. I can't move them. I've got no movement ability on them at all. I cannot... Uh, you may, uh, they may not be able to land for some reason. You might just have to do a previous assault. Definitely keep them on boats. Oh, you're lagging badly. Okay. Yeah, it's me lagging out. Okay, I might actually bring them round to the other side over here, see what happens. I can't attack at the moment, that's for damn sure. So, my apologies there. Um, let's see. Oh, money is okay. So, let's check. Oh, um, hmm. Yeah, TeamSpeak's definitely lagging. Sorry, oh everyone on the video, there's not a lot we can do about it. Yeah, something we have no control over. I shall recruit an agent. A hero. Oh, I've, only, I've got the maximum number of heroes, so I can't. Okay. Oh, he's good. I'm having him. But I can't raise an army. Ass buckets. Okay. Surely they can move or something. I don't know. Right, so let's have a look. Ooh, plebs. Yay. Right, what's good net um Oh, we do that one, I think. In Velifari. Um, okay. Field of Mars. Equites, Principes, and Triari. And the other one... Ah, War Doggies. It's got to be War Dogs from Rome. Rome war bred... War, Rome bred War Dogs, no less. This is how quality they'll be. Right, so, let's get him into there. Military training, if you please, sir. Clippity-clop, clippity-clop, clippity-clop. Right, army is nearly back to full strength outside the town, and nearly back to full strength inside the town, so those two armies will be ready to go soon, in which case we can go and pick on Medlan. And... Income is looking okay. You so, can definitely not move those ships anywhere. <laughs> like, which ship's that? The, your transports down in Syracuse. No, I can't move them at all, mate. I've got no movement oh. movement ability on him at all. I wonder if there's an agent there that's done something to you. Yeah, it's a possibility, mate. It's a possibility. I don't know if you could do it to boats, though. Mm. Yeah, I might. I might, yeah. Yeah, hard on the oars. Haha, <laughs> but boom. Okay, well, we try and land there in the next turn, see what's happened, unless it's bugged out, in which case, that army, I won't be able to move at all, which will be very, very annoying. Yeah, you'd end up having to disband it, probably. Exactly, and it's a good army with a good general. It's a f nearly a full stacker, so. That would slightly annoy me. Anyway, end turn, I think. Right, and given the lag and other issues, I think what we will do is uh, just end the episode there. Indeed. So hopefully everyone enjoyed themselves, and we will see you next week. Cheers, everyone. Bye for now.